Standard 8, Subject English, Lesson Number 1.4, Revati's Musical Plants. Introduction. This short and sweet story tells us about the response of plants to music and reveals that, like us, they too enjoy good music. So let's begin with this story. Revati was a student of music. She was happy playing on her violin whenever she was free. There was a small open courtyard in front of her house with a cement bench. She would sit on the bench and practice on her violin. There were few potted plants in the courtyard. While playing on the violin one day, she noted a pot of balsam plants which is called as touch me not near the wall. The plants were not looking normal. They had pale green leaves and their growth was stunted. She remembered that she had learned in lower classes that plants need light for normal growth. She shifted the pot to the center of courtyard where there was ample sunlight. And suddenly an idea struck in Revati's mind. Why not I participate in the best plant contest which was to be held in her colony a few weeks later? Then and there she decided to participate. She made up her mind. She watered the plants, sat down on the bench, started playing violin. She was very fond of Raga Mohanam. She played the Raga for some time and then went in for her studies. Every day Revati would do the same act. She would sit on the bench, she would play violin and then she would notice the plants. Slowly, gradually she came to know that the plants were growing well and they were looking much healthier as they were before. One day when she was playing violin, she noticed a movement in her potted plants. They were slowly moving the stems, bending slightly towards her. She wondered why they were moving as there was no breeze. It struck as an some odd. The next evening too, she played on her violin as usual, watched the potted plants with care. Revati sat on the bench and played in a different tune, one with quick rhythm. She suddenly saw all the plants turn away from her and they did not like what she was playing on the violin. She started playing her favorite tune Mohanam as usual. Again the plants slowly straightened themselves and bent towards her. She kept this knowledge a secret. Then once she saw the flowers were big, bright and colored. One of the plants had an unusual kind of flowers. She got up in the morning and went straight to the courtyard to see the plants. Revati with a blink of eye, she just saw that she could not see that balsam plant. She searched all over. She asked her mother. Her mother said she knew nothing either about the pots or about the plants. Some of the neighbors had been to their house the previous afternoon. She marked that at the beautiful flowers and the healthy looking plants in the pot. When she couldn't find the balsam plants in her courtyard, Revati's grief knew no bounds. She was very unhappy. She went around asking everyone of her neighbors but no one had any knowledge about it. She could not lodge a complaint for the pot of plants. She felt very bad. Then one day, all her friends were going to the prize distribution ceremony. She did not want to attend it, but her friends forced her. After reaching the place, she went to the benches where the potted plants were displayed. Revati was shocked. There were her pots of plants on the bench with a different name. As a distant neighbor who is a competitor, written a small piece of cardboard and placed it in the soil. She knew it was her pot of plants. She told this to the organizers. 
but the organizers were not convinced how can you prove that the plants are yours the lady who submitted them is a regular participant how can we doubt her revti wondered how to convince them she sat for a few minutes looking at the plants and suddenly she remembered about her violin which flashed across her mind she told the organizers that she can prove that the plants are hers she ran home when she returned a few minutes later with a violin she started laughing and then as usual she just thought that she is going to gain this prize but she told the organizers i know my plants i share a secret with them my plants are music lovers you could see how they are responding when i play to them but the organizers laughed again and again they said do plants have ears like us to enjoy your music no one believed it she felt dejected determined to get her plants back she again played the favorite raga mohanam she was deeply engrossed in the music revti forgot her plants for some time but to the wonder straight at first the plants bent slightly she played a violin on and on the stems bent towards her revti still touched to her happiness the organizers were stunned to see that the balsam plants were responding to the music and revti had become a great discoverer they all applauded and they said they were convinced that the plants were hers and then they pulled up that neighbor for cheating them and she accepted after a long argument she had stolen revti's plants she needed a prize this time she said while walking past revti's house she had spotted the plants and she removed the plant in the night to her house and submitted it for the contest she was a regular participant so no one doubted her after all the authorities decided that revti's plants deserved the first prize as they were the best looking and healthy plants revti carried home the prize proudly with her pot of plants thank you